How you doing there, Joey? Yeah, good uh, for a Sunday afternoon. Beautiful weather, of course. This uh, fresh uh, northerly, um, northerly wind, and it's so refreshing. Had the best sleep for about six or seven months, I reckon. And we're um, about to go to Dramana and get some, uh, maybe some chips. Not too much greasy stuff. And um, relax and enjoy the afternoon before we get into the some of the tasks we've got to do. But it's just so nice and to be just down here. No sand, but plenty of um, uh, you know rewarding and welcoming weather. Anyway, very good to be here. Anyway, we'll uh, we'll head off and do some uh, tasks along the way. Um, what's the what's the date today, Joe? It's the second day of December. Second of December. And yeah. we're on top of the balcony at Mount Martha, and uh, it's been a great pleasure getting down 2,100 kilometres from the Red Centre. And uh, by G by Jingo, it's about 24 degrees, maybe. Yeah, maybe. 24 degrees. Beautiful wind, salt uh, water, air to help our sinuses after the Red Sandy Desert's been throwing up lots of dust. And uh, we're just settling in at Mount Martha. We've set up the computer systems and the communications is on and alive. And uh, we're going to go get some supplies to set some things up and enjoy the rest of our Sunday afternoon uh, catching up with this beautiful, tranquil place. So uh, where are we heading to now, Dad? Dramana. Dramana. And we might even go get some fish and chips just to, uh, just to uh, spoil ourselves rotten. No, it's not easy doing what we do. We just spoke to Danny. He's uh, currently up in the Red Centre uh, celebrating as we speak and uh, it is a time for OH&S, Occupational Health and Safety. So welcome to the day. It's an afternoon here at Mount Martha down in Victoria of Australia and uh, let's get amongst it. Uh, we haven't seen much of what's going on around the world in weather at the moment. We understand that California is still copping a belting with fires and there's a lot of uh, earthquake swarms going on uh, up around Mexico. Uh, something to do with the large masses of water. Something to do with the large mass of water and the cyclones that are pushing up at the top of Mexico there. And uh, no doubt that's causing extra pressure on the plates and, and uh, these earthquake swarms. So we'll keep an eye on that later. Anyway, we'll take you guys down to the coast. That's enough of our wonderful head for now and uh, come and look at some water. So it was good to catch up with Roger last night and uh, and uh, discuss a couple of the social activities that are, the, that are to occur over the coming weeks and a lot of catching up and reflecting at the wonderful 2007. We've got plenty of 60th birthdays and uh, some people who have yet to visit the wonderful Mount Martha are coming to say hello. Always a pleasure to see the ocean. The magnetics of water helps soothe the soul and rejuvenate the spirit. And as said earlier, we've had the best sleep that we've had for a long time. And uh, I think it's more to do with the static electricity that is uh, dissolved with all this massive water around. But we are back in the land of cars and vehicles and people. And uh, but fortunately, Mount Martha is nestled well away from that. And we're about to enter the big world now, the shopping centre, the modern day hunt to uh, find some basic foods to keep us uh, well and occupied at the uh, Mount Martha. We have a guitar for music, a couple of laptop computers to hook up with the internet and maintain the campaign. And uh, we'll also get a very good taste of uh, where these cities are at while we're down here. It's always a stern reminder of uh, where people's consciousness is at, the way they're thinking, the attitudes they have, and um, which is just the reason why we've got to uh, do what we do on this planet now to, uh, to change the way people are thinking. What's coming up ahead now, I think it's, uh, it starts with A and it's a form of abortion. It's 
the uh, tunnel, the Mount Martha Cove tunnel. Marina. The marina. The marina. Take a look at the marina. One's a beautiful coastal seaside lazy little beach. And now a uh, byproduct of a conglomerate corporation feasting its way on money, willing to mutilate a natural cove for its own endeavours. Aren't they a wonderful bunch of people? So considerate of the needs of others and our pristine ecosystems. It is a uh, technically summer here, so you will see a few bikinis around, a few people in their budgie smugglers, and uh, uh, I'm sure there's quite a few jet skis out there at the moment. What you doing, Joey? Oh, my favourite pastime shopping. This is the uh, IGA uh, U Beauty supermarket in uh, in Dramana, and we're came in for a light bit of shopping. Joey's Joey's out of control. He's out of control. Look at all the stuff he's got. But it's all healthy, and it's going to allow us to hibernate at the beautiful Mount Martha for a yeah, few yeah, days. Get so let's get some olives. And you got chicken, Dad? <laughs> All good guys, we'll see you very shortly. We're in uh we're in the uh, the aisles of the modern day hunt. Yeah. That was a very long conversation, uh, just caught up with Mum we're here at Mount Martha. We've had our chips from the beautiful uh, fish and chip shop at Mount Martha, stocked up on some healthy food, uh chair legs here and uh it's a beautiful evening. So uh How are you having, guys? Yeah, good. Uh, Shirley was supposed to prepare some medica medication, but he, he got talking about his little harem visit here, where he's going to be looking after a dozen girls. You know? Fair enough, Dad. Let's hope we're going to have to think of it.